hello good day welcome back to my channel in this short um, tutorial i'm going to demonstrate to you how you can purchase usdt on binance okay how to purchase usdt on binance to either activate your leave good account or you purposely want to use it for other transaction so you go to um, binance you know there are two types of wallet here we have the spot wallet and then the funding wallet so you are going to use the funding wallet and then you click on p2p just below the deposit so once you click on p2p it will display all the merchants here all the merchants that are available here selling usdt with their rate individual rate so you have to check the rate that is favorable to you and two things you must take note for each merchant you see here has their um, the quantity of usdt they have on the system and then the limit you can buy the limit is the minimum quantity of usdt you can buy and then they also have their maximum which is the highest amount you can buy then you also look at one important you look at the payment method so you see this first person crypto is good um payment method is bank transfer so if you are not using bank transfer then you have to go to the next merchant i am going to buy with mobile money so i have to go to the next merchant which is quickie quickie um quickie is a verified me merchant i also give priority to that um quickie has only 20 of which i am buying more than 20 usd therefore i would have to go to the next person jet mines has only 15 um let me go to the next person i moved so i get the quantity i want to buy um i place an order let me check if this person is here vodafone only okay this person is using only vodafone so I have to make sure I'm buying with MTN mobile money. Um, let me look at um, the next person um, that has, I think, Eagle Lion Ada. Okay, this um, merchant I can, I think I can buy from. He is using Vodafone and then MTN Momo. I want to buy with MTN Momo, so I have to consider that as well. Let me see the terms and conditions. Accept Vodafone cash withdrawal. Uh, also accept mtn cash out okay good so i want to buy with mtn cash out so let me enter the quantity i want to buy 636 which is 50 usdt you can also equally use the crypto and then to give you the quantity you have to buy then you click on buy usdt buy usdt so once you click on buy usdt you can use the chat window to chat the merchant here um, you can just chat with him here um, allowing cash out cash out these are the cash out agents okay so I have to give him my number so that I allow cash out at my end once I do that he would do the cash out from his end and then the money will be sent to him then he will release the crypto to me okay so I have to allow cash out here. All right, so cash out is allowed now. Then the next thing is go back to Binance and wait for him to do the cash out. Okay, wait for him to do the cash out Then I accept from my end. I'm waiting for him to respond quickly so I can move on to the next thing. um he has to respond or probably once he has seen that i have given him my number he will do the cash out straight away so i'm i just have some minutes you have 15 minutes to um do the transaction so you have to make sure you are you fall within time you have to make sure you fall within time i'm just hoping that this merchant has has not left the phone somewhere or it's not doing any other thing but maybe he is um, attending to other users okay so he has responded he has responded okay so it means that he is going to do the cash out straight away then i um, accept it then he released the crypto to me okay so as we wait for him to do the cash out there will be a pop-up on my screen showing that he has done the cash out then i can go ahead to do the approval so um in less than some 30 seconds it should be good so um, you see that the cash out withdrawal has come so i have to accept 
um, accept it and then once i accept the cash out i'll quickly go to um so that is it i have released the money to him i'll quickly go and then click on once you have done the cash out or you have sent the money to the merchant you go and then you click on transfer and notify seller transfer and notify seller good so once you click on transfer and notify seller you can go back and tell him you the cash out is done or he could he would equally see at his end okay that you have accepted the cash out and then he will release the assets to you he will release the assets to you so let's wait and see as he um that's the releasing of the assets yes let's wait and see it's in less than one minute he should be able to um release the assets to me okay release the asset to me and kindly take note one of the things you must not overlook is the terms and condition of the merchant you are buying the usdt from always try and read the items and condition before you even engage in a transaction yes it is very very important to um, um take note of that it is very important to take note of that make sure you read the terms and condition of the um merchant before you you would have to proceed so, all right so you could see from the below there that your payment has been received the asset will be sent to you good so the order has been completed as you can see above the the order is now completed you see the transaction details here let me give him a positive feedback because he has been able to um release it to me on time if you want to um so that is it so the asset has now been released to me and then it's now found in my um funding wallet okay the asset is now found in my wallet funding wallet so you could see that i have 50 dollars or 50 usdt in my funding wallet so that is how to go about using mtn mobile money or vodafone depending on the merchant you are buying from to purchase on binance once you have a binance account you can trade you can buy sell usdt but i made this video specifically for live good members who are in ghana okay um you can use if the merchant is accepting vodafone you go through the same procedure if the merchant is um, accepting mtm momo you go through the same procedure even with bank it's the same procedure just that you have to make sure you receive the bank details of the merchant you are buying the usdt from so kindly take note please for don't forget to subscribe to my channel i always um, upload educative program subscribe and then click on the notification bell share this with your team members let us grow together live good we have to indeed live good